Hey there. You're finally awake. How are you holding up? Yeah. You were looking pretty rough out there when I found you. Yeah, you must have hit your head or something. Well, the flooding out there has gotten pretty bad. Luckily, where we're currently at, we're on a hill and the foundation is pretty waterproof, so to speak. Yeah. Now that you're finally up, how about I just look you over, give you a one so hard look for any serious damage? Things like that. Are, are you feeling okay? Is your head hurt? Yeah, a little woozy. That's understandable. Yeah, let me just let me just take a look here. Does does it hurt if I touch your head there? A little bit. What about what about on this side? Any noticeable change in pressure, hearing? Hmm. How about this? I'll hold up a finger, and all you have to do is just follow it back and forth. Pretty simple, right? Okay. Ready? There you go. Yep. Just follow that. Perfect. Now I'll do two. Good. Now let's do two again, but from different sides. seem to have any serious damage. Your eyes are looking and feeling okay. You do have a couple scrapes and a few lacerations. Yeah. Before we came in, I grabbed a first aid kit out of a vehicle outside. Yeah. No, it wasn't my, it wasn't my car. No, it was somebody's car that was just there floating along. <laughs> Got caught in some of the debris, yeah. Uh, but I'll go ahead and see what they have in there. We could probably use some of that to kind of patch you up a bit. Yeah, I have it right here. One sec. a Kia. One of those uh, Kia Souls. Yeah. They're always kind of weird looking to me. This is very sturdy. No, I haven't looked in it. From what I can tell, though, it doesn't seem to be damaged. Let me take a look. try to keep the noises down for you, in case you have a concussion or anything like that. Also, you may have noticed that 
but the power is not currently working. I did have some charged up lanterns, some electric lanterns, yeah. And we have a portable charger for them as well, in case we need it. Yeah, we're doing okay. here, including some gauze, some survival wrap, an ace bandage, some waterproof adhesive tape, which we'll definitely need, I would assume, due to all the rain. some alcohol wipes. Some band-aids and so on. So first what I want to do is I want to treat that cut on your head. Yeah, I think it's where you hit your head before outside. Yeah, you were a little woozy when I helped you up. So what we'll do is we'll get some gauze on there, okay? Go ahead and set this down. Yeah, you can just relax. Take it easy. I'll take care of you. still for me. There we go. I'll just get that up on there. No, it's okay. I'm not squeamish or anything. Yeah, from what I understand, the storm's getting pretty bad. The winds are really starting to pick up now. Over 100 miles an hour, if you could believe it. There we go. There we are. Alright, we got that bleeding to stop a little bit. Got some of that off there for you. happened upon a little bottle of peroxide as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is gonna sting a little bit, okay? But we gotta, we gotta make sure we disinfect it. see too many others that need it right now. But we'll look for more scrapes and cuts in a minute. Then we got this Neosporin. We'll just apply it there. Yeah. You know what? Let me just lightly dab that peroxide a bit. paper towels here. Yeah, they said it's going to be raining for the next two to three days. Severe thunderstorms, hurricane winds, lots of flooding, 
even a lot of tornado watches. But don't worry, I have plenty of supplies here. Yeah, we're gonna be just fine. In in the morning, we can take you wherever you need to be. Yeah, I have a big truck out back. We can just go wherever you need to go. You got family, people nearby. Or if you want, you're more than welcome to stay. Okay, let me just get that peroxide off. There we go. Just let me get a little bit of that off your face there, too. Just fine, don't worry. Storms come and go. It's all about how we deal with them. And we're gonna deal with it just fine. There you go. Yep. Perfect. Just right there. So do well not you I, I need you to rest there's probably some other people I need to go get bring in here start collecting you know people that need help but one thing I need to do is find some boards some nails things like that I know they're here somewhere I'm just gonna find them and start boarding up some of these windows and things yeah, that way we can protect ourselves a bit from flying objects coming through and stuff like that. I know everyone wishes they prepared a bit more before the storm hits, but it was a freak storm. You know what you know what the news said with all the climate change and everything like that and that that comet that appeared seemingly out of nowhere messing with some of the magnetic poles and things just uh we're in unprecedented times yeah but don't worry we're gonna get through this okay i also had some batteries here i found Brand new pack. So we got plenty of battery power too, if we need it. These are uh, Energizer Max. Double A's. Good shelf life. Pretty powerful. A flashlight yeah yeah no problem I can need some fresh batteries probably yeah sure let me help you with that here I'll just see that for a second thank you
Yeah, it's no problem at all. So, where are you from, anyway? From around here? There we go. Got some fresh batteries. You are from around here. Yeah, it's... Times are changing, that's for sure, with all this crazy climate stuff going on. Yeah. I'm from around here, too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I was looking to move soon, but probably have to hold off for at least for a little while. But this is more motivation for me to move. <laughs> yeah. Going south. Yeah, that's where I would be heading. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, friend. I'm sure there's more people out there that need some help. If you're feeling a little bit better and on your feet right here, uh, just go ahead and relax. As I said, I'll be back in to check on you in a little bit. I'm just going to go ahead and do another supply run, look for more people that need help and bring them in too. And if you're feeling up to it in a little while, maybe take a look around, try to fix yourself up something to eat. Yeah, get yourself some water. Mm hmm. No. It's no problem at all. Okay, well, I'm gonna go outside now. And again, stay here and make yourself comfortable. <laughs>